Hi everyone, I'm really happy to be here today to present you the brand new Quicksilver 755 Cruiser. This spacious and sporty cruiser is completing the cruiser series from Quicksilver with a model that perfectly fits between existing 645 and 805 cruiser. One of the things you will notice as well is the very nice, uncluttered, sleek and sporty lines of the boat in a very elegant design. So now I invite you to come on board and have a closer look at all the features. One of the first things you will notice is a very large extended swim platform providing a lot of room at the dock when anchoring and of course when you are at sea to enjoy swimming, going in the water, going back on the boat. Of course you get the integrated ladder, very easy to deploy and very easy to put back. So this boat offers single motorization Mercury going from 175 HP to 300 Verado. At the back of the boat you get a very nice uh, storage, integrated canvas storage, very easy to open and as you can see the Bimini is stored here. You can just take it and deploy it within a few seconds creating the Bimini and of course you can decide to have the optional full enclosed canvas closing the boat. And of course as well on starboard side the nice cockpit shower. So on the 755 Cruiser you can decide to get the optional galley, permanent galley. As you can see very robust, very stylish, very easy to open. You've got the integrated sink, stainless steel, pressured water and of course the LPG stove. And of course underneath the galley plenty of storage here dedicated area for the gas bottle and here on the right side plenty of place for your cooking pan and other material. So let me give you some specification. The boat has a length of 699, 23 foot, a width of 255, 8.3 foot, a very deep hull, 20 degrees dead rise. So another thing you will notice in the cockpit area, a very secure feeling due to the very high freeboard for maximum safety for children and people on board while driving. Under the seating, very deep, a lot of room. So we've got dedicated place for the ski mast. As you can see, we have a place for everything and everything has a place. So let me show you the nice features in this very nice cockpit. You've got a very nice and large L seating. So the inclinable backrest of a three different position, straight for dining, 45 degrees for relaxing and chilling and reading. And of course you can put it flat to create the very large uh, sun deck that we will see. And of course to get a very easy access in and out of the water. And a huge area for sun bathing. As you can see here, the backrest from the co-pilot seat can be flipped to the front and offers even more room. So we've seen a very versatile cockpit area. The last position is the dining arrangement. As you can see, a very nice, real thick table, offering a lot of room for four to five people to have dinner. So let me show you the middle area of the boat. First thing to show is uh, Drawer fridge located under the co-pilot seat. So the double co-pilot seating offers a lot of room as you can see. At the front, a very nice storage for small items. The fusion stereo, a new feature here on that boat. The very nice integrated armrest, blue LED cup holder, as well as a 12V connection and a very nice USB connection for your iPhone, iPad and just to put music on the stereo. So as you can see here, a very balanced and stylish design between the helm station and the area in front of the co-pilot. So very modern and very stylish. Another thing you will notice directly is the permanent access to the bow area as well as the permanent access to the cabin. As you can see here, a very nice, modern and ergonomic helm station. As you can see, a lot of room, enough space for a 9-inch GPS chart plotter, smart craft instrumentation, adjustable 
steering wheel position. Of course, the same feature that we have on port side, the cup holder with LED blue light. You've got the 12 volt uh, connection. So here you can see very easy to use and just falling under your end. The flip flap system and the left side, the different buttons, windshield, washer, the light, the horn, and all the other equipment. And as well, of course, a bolster seat. Very easy to deploy, very comfortable. And of course, you can adjust the seat, the eight, and the seat is of course turning. So as you can see here, a very large Ford Exxon lounge, very comfortable for reading, relaxing, or just sunbathing. So welcome in the cabin. First thing you'll notice, a lot of light in the cabin, thanks to the very large skylights, very large side windows on both starboard and port side. A lot of room, very comfortable double berth. And of course, side curtains, privacy curtains on both sides of the boat. Nice feature here as well. Small storage for your belongings, as well as a 12V, 12 volt connection. Let me quickly show you the storage under the berth. Very easy access. And a lot of room. A wooden step for very easy access into the cabin. The wooden step can be flipped up. This brings more room at that place. Here, very nice detail too to be mentioned. The small bench here at the entry of the cabin. Very nice just to come, take out your shoes and get ready to go on your berth. And also here, another storage under the bench. Very easy access, nice room for your belongings. And also something to notice here, nice recess on the side of the boat. So you can decide to take the optional fully enclosed toilet. As you can see, a nice room for a boat of this size, curtains, and of course, opening port lights for ventilation. The port lights are on both starboard and port side next to the hull window. As you've seen, the 755 Cruiser has been shaped on the consumer needs, looking for a boat in the 7 meter segment, and for those seeking fun, relaxation, and adventure at a very competitive price, and without compromising luxury, quality, and performance. So this is for sure to be a big hit in the Quicksilver lineup. For more information, details, please check out our website, quicksilverboats.com, or just contact your local dealer. Thank you and see you on the water.